everyone, Enigma Coin Collector here. And in this video, we're gonna take a look at the packages that have been sent to me over the past few months at my new location, at my new P.O. Box. So if you ever wanna send in anything, check out the P.O. Box information listed in the video description below. I've got about five or six things that I filmed over the past few months, so I don't have all the items here with me right now, but I do have the video segments when I got them and as I received them, I took the videos and I'm gonna stitch them all together for this video. Got a lot of really cool donations to the channel and I hope you check out all of the channels that donated to mine. To everyone who's donated or sent something in, thank you very much and if you ever want to, send me a letter. I will send you a channel sticker back free of charge. All right, enough chit chat. Let's take a look at the donations over the past few months that I've gotten in my P.O. Box. And our first package on this mail call is this box from the US Mint and I've already opened it so I know what's inside. Here we don't show any of the packaging details. And I am excited for these. I've been getting these for a while now. And these are the 2021 Kennedy Half Dollars from the Philadelphia and Denver Mints. And we are gonna be opening these because I actually am gonna use these for giveaways on the channel, no ender on that one, but here they are. This is the Denver Roll. And this is going to be the Philadelphia Roll. So let's go ahead and get into these and check out these coins. New 2021 Kennedy Half Dollars. Now those are some NIFC edges. Wow. I probably should be using gloves, but that is okay. I am going to put these coins in tubes. Let's see if I can just get one here. Yeah. Beautiful design, the Kennedy. 2021P. And there are those edges again. Twenty twenty one D. So, like I said, I'm going to be using these in some giveaways here shortly. I wanted to get this film so I could go ahead and use them, but there they are the twenty twenty one Kennedy half dollars ready to go. And our next piece of mail on this mail call is from none other than Jinx Brothers. <laughs> Random act of coinness. That's cool, Jinx. ECC, I know that with the move, you've not been hunting as much as you did before. The coin shortage also does not help things. Since you've not seen them yet, I have included two sets of the P&D Crossing the Delaware for you to do with as you please. Your new banks uh, have been amazing. I hope they continue to produce great boxes, keep up the great work, and a thousand will be here before you knew it. Know it. There's Jinx Brothers. Jinx Brothers, thank you very much. I have not seen these in the wild yet other than the proof sets. And take a look at those. That is really cool. The old quarter design. I am for sure gonna be keeping one of these. Might use another set as a giveaway. Jinx Brothers, that is incredibly generous and thoughtful of you. Thank you very much. If you guys haven't checked out Jinx Brothers, I'll put a link to their channel here in the video. Check them out, give them a subscription, and tell them Enigma Coin Collector sent you. Thank you very much, Jinx. Next up is a package from none other than Rob Finds Treasure, and I actually won my first auction on his channel the other day, and uh, his auctions tend to get up there, but he did have some wheat pennies wheat cents that I needed for my collection and was very fortunate to go ahead and grab them. So he sends this with all of his auction winners, box donators, which is really, really cool. Uh, and this was on the stream that I actually sponsored. So four Wheaties, and these are harder dates to get. 1922D, 23S, 26S, and 31D paid $30. Gotta find the other ones, be right back in the package. Good thing I checked. Um, but yeah, I got these and uh, they are gonna fill holes in my album. So what I thought I would do is I would show you them and uh, then we would go ahead and put them in the album. Let me take these out. I'll show them as I put them in the album. So I'm gonna need my older album. There we go. 
And I think they were a pretty good deal. Um, they are all gonna fill spots, like I said. We'll start with this 22D, the oldest. And they are worn. They are not great examples, but they fill a spot, which is awesome. 22 Denver is going to go right there. 22 Denver, 7.1 million minted. Next up, if I can get it out, is the 23, and it is very faint, 23S. There is an S there. The estimate mark is super faint, but that is going to fill a spot as well. And then a 26S, the 23S, 8.7 million minted. So a little bit more. 26S, you can see a little bit better, a little easier on that S. 26S, 4.5 million minted. And then a 1931 Denver. Yeah, you can see that Denver mint mark really, really well. 31 Denver. 4.4 million minted. So upgrading the Wheat Penny album thanks to an awesome opportunity from Rob Finds Treasure. Rob, thank you very much. The Wheat Penny album is definitely coming along and hopefully we'll fill it <laughs> sooner rather than later, but it's going to take a while, especially that one what are you gonna do and our next package is from the flashy collector flashy collector thank you very much good sir you did not have to send in anything and we've got a channel sticker from the flashy collector my coin sorter is covered in these things this sticker is going to get added onto it here as soon as i'm done with this video so that's very awesome thank you very much the flashy collector Hey Enigma, thanks for being my first subscriber and for supporting my YouTube channel. I have learned a lot from your channel and our chats and I appreciate your encouragement as I started my own channel. As a token of my appreciation, I've included a channel sticker and two of my favorite finds from my first Penny Hunt video. Congratulations on making it to a thousand subscribers. What an awesome milestone. You post such great content and host some fun live hunts. So there's no doubt you surpassed 2K in no time. Happy hunting the Flashy Collector. Thank you very much. That is very kind of you, the Flashy Collector. Yeah, and let's see what we got here. Oh, wow, cool. 20, 2020, sorry, 2012 Penny Rainbow Toning. That is really cool. I'm trying to get that centered in the frame. I don't know if you can see that on the camera, but that is a really nice toned Penny. And what else? 1930 Wheats, and I remember you finding this, the Flashy Collector. Very cool. Flashy Collector, thank you very, very much. Check out the Flashy Collector. I'll put his channel in the video description below. Check him out, subscribe to him, and uh, we're gonna be doing a live stream. If I think it might've actually already happened, but um, either way, we're gonna be doing a live stream with the Flashy Collector with a box of half dollars. Check him out. Thanks, Flashy. And the last package on this mail call is gonna be from Patrick Johnson, my one and only moderator. So Patrick, thank you very much for sending in the package and very generous. Hey Enigma, the large send is for you and the rest is for a giveaway. Keep up the great work, Patrick Johnson. Patrick, you did absolutely not need to send this in. Holy cow. Be careful removing the coins. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see if I can get these out here. Patrick, I'm sorry, I'm kind of destroying the letter. There's that one. So, this is gonna be my first ever large scent, Patrick, so I don't have any of these. And this is a 19, 19, no, 18, sorry. Let me take a look at this. 
1837. Let me, let me get this. I'm going to get it out of the plastic because it's just so cool. I'm, I'm really, really excited right now, Patrick. I will. I promise I'm going to put this in a good home. Look at that. 1837. United States of America, one cent. I'm going to have to get the album for this because I don't have it because I don't have any large cents until now. And this is going to be the oldest coin in my collection now. How cool is that? Patrick Johnson, thank you very, very much. And on top of that, he is sent in, holy cow. This is an incredible giveaway for the channel, guys. So make sure you thank Patrick Johnson. He sent in a 1943 silver quarter, a flying eagle sent, 1857, I believe, a 1905 Indian head penny. Oh my gosh, a 1943 walking liberty and a 1955 Wheat scent in beautiful condition. If that's the DDO, that is insane. It's not, but holy cow, Patrick Johnson, you did not have to do this. And I've already sent your channel sticker. It's in the mail. Hopefully, you have it already. We're going to use this on a future live stream. I'll probably do it the week of the video release for this mail call just so that you guys can see and get a preview. Thank Patrick Johnson so much for his generosity and kindness because that is insane. Patrick Johnson, thank you very much for the gifts. Now that's going to wrap up this edition of the mail call. Remember, you can always send in something to the PO box, which is listed below in the video description, and you don't have to send in anything at all. In fact, you can email me as well if you want a channel sticker. I don't ask for anything in return. If you want one, just drop me an email and I will put one in the mail for you. Um, but if you want to send anything into the channel, go ahead and send it to the PO box. I want to thank everyone for watching. Remember, it's always a mystery until you croak open those rolls or the mail and see what you got inside. Thanks for watching, everyone. Catch you on the next one. Take care. All right, Patrick. We're going to end the video showing you my new large scent album I just got in the mail an hour ago. And you're, I'm sorry, I said 57. It's an 1837. My oldest coin in my collection. The only coin in the album. And that bad boy is going right in there. Very cool.